This training video will cover the differences between saving your changes and exporting your changes. When you are finished with a video in Video Surgeon, you really have three options. You can simply close the program and lose any changes that you've made to this video. And for some or many videos, that may be just fine. A second option that you have is to select the Save button. And when you select the Save button, you'll open a dialog window and you'll give it a name and it will save the file as a .vsp or Video Surgeon Project File. Just what is a Video Surgeon Project File? Well, essentially it preserves the integrity of the underlying video, mean, meaning that it makes no changes to the underlying video. But what it does remember for any changes that you've made while the program is open. So if you've applied a tempo change, if you've applied markers, if you've set up loop points, if you've made a pitch change, any of these different settings. If you save it, or I should say when you save it as a Video Surgeon project file, it will save all of those changes and then when it's open at a subsequent or future time, it will reapply all of those changes to the underlying or the base video. So it's a way in which you can save a project within Video Surgeon and open it back up within Video Surgeon without having to reapply all of these settings if it's something you're going to use routinely. The difference between that and exporting is that when you export, you actually make changes permanent. What types of changes can you make permanent? Well, if you have tempo changes applied, if you have pitch changes applied, if you do any type of editing down here with regard to cutting or deleting parts of the video or adding parts to the video or inserting silence or any of these functionalities here. When you export, those changes will be embedded and become permanent. And really what that means then is that those changes become portable as well. And that's one of the differences between saving and exporting. If you save something as a Video Surgeon project file, you can only open it and only really use it in Video Surgeon. However, if you export it, those changes become embedded, they become permanent, and therefore you can play it back in any other video player that you have, whether it's on your computer or whether it's a portable player of some kind or whether you, know, you somehow get it onto a DVD and you play it back on your video player or I should say on your DVD player. We do have an additional training video on exporting and we go into a little more detail there, but the purpose of this video is really just to give you an overview of these two options that you have and the differences between them. So you'll know whether you want to save something or whether you want to or need to export it depending upon how you intend to use it. So that will conclude this training video.